In this video, you will learn how to bulk update users using a .csv file in a network. Instead of adding individual users, you can add or update multiple users by using a .csv file. To do this, on my Yammer homepage, on the left-hand side, I'll click Admin. Then, from the drop-down menu, I'll click User Management. Next, on the left-hand side, in the Users section, I'll click Bulk Update Users. On the Bulk Update Users page, you can add, update, suspend, or delete users. For that, you'll need to format your .csv as a table in Excel. Here I have the .csv file formatted as a table with headers as Action, Email Address, Full Name, and Job Title. I'll go back to the Bulk Update Users page. If you indicate New as the action and specify a password, the user will be created as active and immediately show up in the member directory. If you indicate Update as the action, the existing Yammer account will remain the same. However, the other fields, name, title, password, and email address, will change to match those in the CSV. If you indicate Suspend as the action, the user account will be suspended until the user verifies their status via an email request. If you indicate Delete, the user account will be deleted, but their messages and attachments will remain in the network. Under the Choose Update Options section, I'll keep the Create New Accounts for Usernames that do not yet exist checkbox selected. I'll also keep the Send Set Password Emails to New Users with Blank Passwords selected. Under the Upload List of User Accounts in CSV Formats section, I'll click the Browse button. Then, in the Choose File to Upload dialog box, I'll select the file I want to upload. I'll click Open. Next, I'll click the Bulk Update button. I'm taken to the Bulk Account Update page, in which my users will be updated to the network. I can see how long the process will take, as well as the number of failures that occurred during the update. In my case, there were two failures. I'll click the Show Failures link and I'll be shown a list of users and why they failed to update. Finally, I'll click the Home tab and I can see that my new users have been added to the network. In this video, you've learned how to bulk update users using a .csv file in a network.